Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. This is GGF, bringing you episode 15, and hopefully error and glitch free of Let's Try Gloomhaven. Hope you guys are doing well. I do apologize for the last two videos, the fact they're being kind of... They seem fine at first, and then they become choppy for some reason. That makes really no sense at all to me. I did change uh, a few settings to hopefully make them better. See, there's no way to really test this off screen because there's just an autosave feature. And whatever I do in the campaign is going to be saved. But I did turn it to like, no, this isn't supposed to be full screen. It's supposed to be borderless. This is supposed to be, nah, it didn't save my choices for some reason. We're gonna go all the way down to like 60 Hertz on this. Disable V-Sync, FPS will turn down to 60, so this should be saved. So if we go to options, we shouldn't have any problems with these settings. My laptop is more than capable. It's just a freak kind of thing in the game that is causing it to go bad. So I can't really explain it. We're just going to continue here. We're in the middle of a combat. And, uh... Yeah, let's tackle it. We have more enemies to kill. It's round five. And a new round begins. So let's get into it. We've got a mystic ally. Okay, demolitionist. What do we want you to do? There's some obstacles, which are good for us. Um, oh, you need to take a short rest. So take a short rest. Uh, pretty sure that's what we want her to do. Bada bing, and we're gonna remove... Mm. I kinda wanna redraw. That has an attack of four after a... Containing an obstacle, I like that card. <sighs> Let me redraw. Attack three, oh this isn't one I wanted to burn either, but whatever. Right here, we're going to, let's see. Uh, we'll go with Hatchet first. Tag three, range two, target two. Um, hmm. Oh wait, she could pick cards now. Um, destroy one object, gain one XP, and perform strengthen on self, then attack three. And he okay, heals don't work. The big one, I don't want to bust that out yet. Destroy an object and perform bless. Target one adjacent enemy. Okay, we probably want to do rubble, an attack of four. And then just a generic movement. Um, card, basically. Or let's do this strengthened one. Destroy one adjacent obstacle. If you do gain one strength, we'll do knock out the support. And then rubble. Which also may end in a hex containing an obstacle. see how it goes. You have to remove all your burned cards. Um, let's see. Flame strike. Um, flame strike. Or use a generic move and then recover all your burned cards. I guess is how we're going to play it. Hatchet. Attack 3 at a range of 3, attack 2, target a different enemy within range 2 of the target. Um, double the value of your next attack this round, that gets burned. Double throw gets burned. Let's see. Do ricochet and a generic movement. And then red guard, we have... Um, 
that movement on the bottom gets changed. Attack one, range three. Move two, attack one, range three. Plus one attack, pull two. All attacks gain disadvantage this round. And then blade dance. So let's do blade dance and healing sands. Let's see how it goes. All right, here we go. Demolitionist turn. So move two and gain strength in. Gains advantage on all attacks. Um, and then can move to an end in another obstacle, gaining another XP point and performing an attack of four that has been strengthened. So let's go this way. Um, come right here. I think I'm doing this right. Skip movement. Knock out that obstacle. And he's strengthened, or she's strengthened. Then go ahead and do rubble, which can end in an obstacle. And then skip movement. Can attack either one of these with advantage, and that one has retaliate. Attack three or attack four. Um, That one's gonna move three, attack two, target two. Two attack. Oh man. Um, how much is it gonna retaliate? Two. Oof. Let's just attack this one. Minus one, plus one. Okay. That works. Lurker elite's turn. That's not good. Coming down here. Minus two to nothing. But getting in the way here, and there goes her, the Mystic Ally. That one's gonna attack there. Time zero, nice. Red Guard's turn. He's gotta really move up there. Those two can deal with that guy easily. So let's see. All enemies move through, suffer one or two damage. No, we wanna use this. Move three. But then we have attack one at a range of three. Let's go up here, range of three, we can attack there. I don't think retaliate works for ranged attacks. Then move two, we could skip that attack one at a range of three and get the plus one attack. So let's just come up here. And um, get that disadvantage against, even though it doesn't really matter. And then attack one. That, oh, he's going to retaliate? Oh, man. And this one is attack zero because it's got a shield. Plus one, so it does one damage. Then we get to move two. Um, and then attack, uh, consume that. And attack here. Don't give me a times two. Oh, oh it only did three and then skip the pool and uh and the turn spellweaver's turn move four and jump so we can jump into the action oh no we need to recover all burn cards don't we what are her discarded cards right now no, we could get by with a discard right now, I think. So let's jump here. And then do an attack of three. Uh, on that one, hopefully get a plus one. Times two, that works. Hatchet. Oh, he's got to get in there. 
let's do a generic move so we don't burn these cards up. Attack 3 at a range of 4, target 2, that's a double. Attack 3 at a range of 2, let's go with Ricochet, so I guess try to use a generic movement. But that range of 3, 2, 3 is not going to cut it. Double throw though, is only going to hit 1. gonna nearly get the bang out of our buck there and we still have a lot of more enemies to move so I'm not gonna burn double th let's see hatchet has already burned power pitch should really not burn double throw so let's just do a generic uh, walk up And uh, yeah, just skip attack. Frosty Demon Elite's turn. Damage six. Yikes! Burn an available card. Um. Probably get rid of one two punch, I guess. Wait. Yeah, one two punch. Whew. This is not looking good. Alright, Red Guard has to short rest. to burn that one draw desert night yeah burn desert night um and then let's see demolitionist tag three plus muddle go ahead and muddle the golem or better yet There's an obstacle. You can move one, two, three. No. One. If someone can kill this one, yeah, we can do that. Do the move three, destroy an adjacent obstacle and gain bless from it. And then um, for the attack, we'll do implode to muddle the big guy. You can... way to deal with this immobilize let's maybe throw a flame shroud on and then move two shields one probably and then she has to do a short rest. Whatever, just burn it. And then do Flame Strike and Reviving Ether. And hatch it. You can do a short rest. Yep, burn that. And we'll go. Um. Move three, heal one in a range of one. And then do an attack of... Ricochet. 
So do probably a care package and a ricochet. And I guess we Gucci. Let's see how it goes. I don't know. Thankfully, they both act after his Redgar's turn first. Attack two, target two, range of two. So we're going to move to shield one. Right here. Get a shield. Throw up the flame shroud. I was saving it. And... That's it. Hatchet's turn. So we have to take out this guy. Um, let's move three, heal one, range one. So we can move right here. Um, ability, heal homie right here. Nice. And, uh... Then ricochet. Confirm target. Um, attack two at a range of three. Oh, target a different enemy within the range of two. Kind of want to use my eagle eye gauntlets. Um, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Clear targets. Can we attack you? That's an attack of two. What are, what are her moves again? Recover burned cards and then attack to range of two, which is nothing. I know we gotta take out um, this one right here. Could add a stun to the golem, but. Oh. And then, oh, target another one? Okay. And we'll add a stun to it. Bada bing, bada boom. Minus one, that's okay. Does one and stuns them. Perfect. Now she's got to. Uh, now, wait a minute. Yeah, she's got all burn cards, so. She can move four. Oh, wait a minute, we don't have to burn. We don't have to burn. We can move and then flame strike. So let's do that. Let's save it. Let's move four, jump four, or move four, jump, and then attack of three in a range of two. We'll move her like right there. And then attack three at a range of two. Do we want to consume for a wound? No, we don't. Just confirm the targets. Oh, done. All right, now. Move three, destroy an obstacle. Yeah. Get movement, destroy the obstacle. Blesses oneself. Card deals double damage. Nice. XP plus one, and then attack three, attack plus one muddle. We'll consume that. Bada bing, bada boom. Plus two, damage six. Nasty. We took damage two, we'll take it. Plus she loots. All right. Round seven. Here we go. Not too bad so far. Um, we can attack three, immobilize, and um, do a generic movement, maybe, or move three. Healing Sands. So let's go. 
Um, I'll go. Might as well go. Shield of the Desert. Attack of three. Now let's go shocking advance for the immobilization, and then. Um, move three, I guess. You need to short rest. Uh, yeah. She's almost done. Um, can't. Has a lot of bl burned cards. I need to get better at using her. Um, maybe piston punch. And move three to get to that door over there. Uh, destroy one adjacent obstacle, gain bless. Piston punch and implode. Spell weaver can take a short rest. No, do not burn that one. Oh, that's a hard one to burn. Oh my gosh, I exhausted her. Oh, are you kidding me? I totally messed that up. Totally. <sighs> that is such a bummer. I tried to squeeze out just a little more. Three push two center mass and now we're in so much trouble. Extra lift, I guess. Oh, that was such a bummer. Attack of three immobilize. Come on, come on, come on. Time zero. Zero damage. And receive two damage. And we'll move three. Yeah. <sighs> Drink the potion. Yeah, we're we're in a lot of trouble now. It just gained all kinds of shields. Took a damage though. Match it. Attack three, range of three. Is actually attack one, but we can use the eagle eye goggles. Just get rid of this guy, please. Plus one. There we go. Awesome. It keeps turning my camera for some reason. It wants this camera shot. I apologize for that. Let's just do a generic move so we don't... You know, I can't can't believe we lost the Spellweaver. That's so bad. Demonologist. Um, move three. And just... Let's skip attack. I should be picking up the gold because there's nothing stopping me. Oh, I guess the cards being drawn is stopping me. Look how many enemies are left, and I can't believe that Spellweaver situation. Oh, man. Alright, um... Well... We're gonna use the move plus three. And then... Disorienting Barrage. Bread Guard. Just do a generic move plus two, and your attack wants to be. Uh, Blade Dance. And Demolitionist. Move three, and. Rubble. I don't know. I don't know. What are we waiting for?
waiting for everybody picked, right? Oh, you just picked Blade Dance and... What else were you supposed to pick? Oh, generic, uh... Generic move. Um, which will be Shield of the Desert, I guess, and Blade Dance. Oh boy. Generic move. Can't even get up there. But we might be able to do this. Okay, skip the attack. But the movement, uh huh. Mm. Oh my gosh. And there's another door yet. Okay, then we get an attack. Attack of one, range three. Plus one, damage zero. Yeah, we're certainly done for here. Move three. And, uh... Skip attack. Move three. Generic attack. Oh, rubble. Move two. Attack of four if it ends in an obstacle, which it's not going to. Just move anyway. And, and, yeah. Attack three. Whatever. We really need our spell weaver. Just chalk this one up as a, as a loss, guys, but tried our best. Attack three. Plus two. Burn two discarded cards. I don't know. Um, these two, rubble and impulse, uh, keeps her alive, I guess, for a little bit. Round nine. <laughs> oh man, red guard's doing pretty good. Um, maybe those dudes are too hard for me to play. I know the spell weaver is not too hard for me. We can handle her, but I just kind of don't mess it up there where I shouldn't have. But we can repeat this quest in the future. It's no big deal. You, and we still get the XP and stuff we earned and the gold. So, all right, you, um, let's see. You can do a generic move with the flaming sickle. Two twirling staffs and flaming sickle. You short rest. I have to burn the big one and then it's all over, so. Hatchet, uh, fancy hat, and double throw. See how far we can go. Move three. Double the value of your next attack this round. No. Generic move two. Um, come here, I guess. And then skip the movement and attack at a range of four. Attack three. Two targets, double throw. 
hope for the best. Plus zero. Red guard. Um, target all adjacent enemies. So let's do a generic move here. See, now that we're in here, we're kind of handling our biz a little bit. Attack of zero. Add a stun. Yeah, why not? It's, it's over with anyway. Oh, kill them both. Use a shield. Oh, wait, that's for the rest of the round. No. Undo. Although they do act. Nice. Attack two, plus one. See damage. <sighs> Redraw. Yeah. Let's see, you take, um, attack two, range of two, target two. That would be pretty nice. All enemies move through suffer one damage. Move of four, you can go one, two, three, four, or damage three and stun. Yeah, go one, two, three, four, and then target them both. So yeah, we'll do that. Um, Oh no, that's going to burn that card, though. We can't burn any cards right now. Uh, let's go Shocking Advance and Swift Strength. Could also pull one into that trap and hatch it. Short Rest, uh, Fancy Hat, go ahead. And we'll get, um... Extra lift would be good. Move three, push two. Move three, heal one, range of one. Yeah, let's go care package. Extra lift. And care package. Yeah, hope for the best. Take out as many of them as we can. All right. Confirm you two. Attack two, range two. Come on, come on, come on. Minus two. Skip pool of that one. Right, skip the pool. Minus one, damage zero, but we want to do a pull there. Confirm pull. Boom. We're so close. If our spell weaver were alive, this would be totally a win for us. Uh, get that shield going. And I'm going to move three because this one's going to move two and attack three. So let's move three, and this one's going to move two, attack two at a range of two. So let's actually move... Uh, one, two. Yeah, just confirm that movement. Hatchet. Um, move three, heal one. He's going to move two. Which means he's gonna come down here and attack for three. We can handle three. So we'll move Hatchet in there to do a attack two at a range of three. Plus one to try to kill that one. 
Um, skip movement. Heal one. See, we work together well with these two. And then we'd have Spellweaver. We'd definitely be ahead of the game. Take you and consume it. Come on, come on, come on. Plus one. Done. Disarm all traps within two, ra two range. And then this turn. Oh, it's gonna hit both of them. No. Damage four, we'll just... Burn an available card. All his cards are too good. No, we can heal self, so we'll receive the damage. Round 11. Let's get this angle on it. Alright, you... Gotta hit him hard. If we don't have it, um... Twirling stabs and a generic move, move ability, I guess. Attacks gain disadvantage and twirling stabs. Match it. Second wind heal self and move two adjacent enemies. Suffer one damage, then suffer two. We'll do the disorienting barrage. No point in saving it right now. Let's go. Okay. Shows you what they're going to do, right? Uh, let's heal self. And then let's move. Adjacent enemies suffer one damage. Two gold, two gold. We'll come up this way. Suffers damage, no retaliation. Movement. Oh, I guess he doesn't pick up the gold? Maybe at the end. What am I doing? Undo that. Oh my gosh, I just ruined it. Skip ability. Lost out on two damage. See, mistakes like that. I should probably go to the main menu and redo it. Anyway, move three. Come over here. At least get the gold. And then attack. Plus one attack. To retaliate. Ugh. He would have had four damage left. Oh, that's fine. We'll take that. Round 12. Um, flaming Sickle and all enemies move through suffer one damage. And we'll go Flaming Sickle. Blade Dance and Flaming Sickle. Hatchet. Center Mass and Ricochet. It's pretty much that simple. He's going to move to attack three at a range of two and consume those to get plus two attack plus one range. Hatchet's turn. Um, let's do a generic move here. Come up here. And then do an attack three at a range of three and hope we get maybe a times two. That'd be awesome. Plus zero. No retaliation? Huh. Ooh, attack three. Wait a minute, we may still have a fighting chance here. 
come here. Is there a trap on the door? There is. Oh no. Okay. Attack three at a range of two. So we'll move here. Uh, skip movement. Attack here. Come on, give me a good attack. Good, perfect. We're still going, guys. Don't ask me how. But we're still in it. There's a couple enemies left, I guess. Um, short rest. I mean, uh, I guess. No, redraw. Twirling stabs. Oh, that's even worse. And he has two HP left. Do a heal self and a generic move. We'll do move two, shield one. I have to think those cards that create the element too, those are important. So we'll actually go shocking advance. And healing sands and then hatch it. Do a short rest. We're almost out of the game here. Care package. And redraw. Ricochet. Oh boy. And he'll do um movement of three. Now let's um Move three, heal one. We'll do care package and uh, center mass and care package. Red guard. Heal self. I mean, we're getting valuable XP, which is good. Move three. Open the door. Hmm. We're so close. And we can move one more in the door. Perfect. Hatchet. Just move up here. Can't heal anybody, so skip it. Can't attack here, though. Hope for a, a lucky hit. Oh, lucky hit. Oh my gosh, could we still do this? It's going to be a long shot. That one's moving. It's going to be a long shot. Time zero, son. Time zero. Oh, Hatchet takes two damage. This living spirit's turn. Oh my gosh, that one died for some reason. What the heck? All this gold and treasure, too. This one has three shields, a living spirit, elite. Oh my gosh, we're somehow... Oh, because it moved into his target range, that's why. He's got the flame shroud. Okay, attack one at a range of three. Flying. Um, then move two. Then attack one range of three, plus attack one and pull two. So we could potentially end up on this chest. Oh, there's an attack of three. Uh, move two, shield one. How about swift strength and then blade dance? Or we can move one, two, three, four use that movement and then attack two at a range of two better yet attack three at a range of two so let's go blade dance and flaming sickle I think I think that's the ticket and hatchet short rest has to burn whatever comes up care package burn it and he takes extra lift and center mass and we make it work Bada bing, bada boom, we go before 
Here we go, Hatchet's turn. Um... Attack three at a range of three. We're gonna have to hope for like a miracle here. Plus one. One damage. And then burn this up, I guess. Or no, just do a generic move. So he lasts longer. <laughs> Move in here. No gold to get immediately. There's a trap there, isn't there? No. Oh, there's gold there, right? I didn't see that. Red guard, attack three. No, we want to do this. Move a four. Enemies move through stuff for one damage. Let's do that. Do a waypoint here. And then come here. And this one is done. Wait, 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 wait. We want to consume that. Wait, we're fine. We're fine. Boom. Damage one. Oh, wait, we can consume it. <laughs> oh my gosh, we did it, guys. I can't believe it. And we get the chest. Oh my gosh. That was insane. Skip attack. Yep, got the chest, which is a... Loot's doomed something or other. Holy cow, what a battle. So we're very good with Red Guard and Hatchet. We've j I've just got to get better with Spellweaver, which this I'm pretty good with her. Calm, and the Lurkers have retreated. You've looted what you can from the ship, and are very eager to sail back to Gloomhaven to get your feet onto warm, dry land. I have to do better with the de Demolitionist. Maybe I'll get a Brute instead. You take one last look at this strange island and its impaled ship, then do exactly that. Nice, guys. Oh my gosh. Look at these records being set. These don't seem like records, though. See, Spellweaver in a limited time was doing so much damage. Hatchet, although we did good damage with the Demolitionist and earned a lot of XP. Um, use no items. Two perk points for Spellweaver. And take only short rest. Got a perk point. Red Guard used four items. Hatchet, three... Demolition is three. A record of nine healing done by Hatchet. Three gold piles looted. All oh, those are personal records, I think. Maybe? I don't know. Weird. 31 damage done, but yeah. Maybe we'll stick with the Demolitionist. I don't know, but I can't believe we won that, guys. That was crazy. 10 XP, 6 XP. She's getting up to 7 to 20 before she retires. Saradelia City Encounter. Uh, I'm going to save here, guys, because that was insane, and I can't believe we beat it. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Um, stay tuned, because next time we're going to take on more quests and figure this out. I may, in fact... Well, she's about to level up, so we should probably keep the Demolitionist. She's about to level up. Mark leveled up. He's about to level up. Very good stuff. I'm getting the hang of it. You know, I can survive now knowing those burned cards. Uh, you can, you want to keep them for as long as you can rather than just burning through them. But use them where necessary as well. So it's a balancing act, but it's very fun. Very cool. Glad we succeeded. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Come on back. More fun to be had. Be well, live well, stay well, guys. And much love and peace and joy to all of you. And I will see you all in the next one. Don't go anywhere. Peace.